So in a dream, I see Trump. In this dream, I seen Trump and he was standing on his platform and he was standing behind his pulpit and it was so many people behind him. But in a dream, somehow I knew that these people that was behind him wasn't actually standing with him. It was just a representation of the nations, the different nations, basically. It was every nationality up there except for Israel, that was it. All the other nations was up there standing behind him, basically. And then after that, I seen, and I had this dream a year and a half ago too. All these dreams I had, I had about literally like weeks apart from each other. Right across his face in a dream, it said Amalek. Mind you, y'all, I had shortly just had came into the truth. I didn't know, I didn't know nothing about you know, to really, we was learning. We were still learning who we were. So I dang sure didn't know nothing about the biblical names of the nations. I didn't know nothing about Amalek. I didn't know none of that. So in a dream, after I seen Amalek, of course, after I woke up, I went and I looked it up. And lo and behold, Amalek is our enemy, man. It is our enemy. He is our enemy. He is part of these Edomites. And so in a dream, it said Amalek right across Trump. And then right after that happened, I seen in my dream, it was Trump's finger that pushed the button to start World War III. It was plain as day, I seen it. And then I can remember the scene changed. It was me, my husband, and then my sister. And we was in like this park and it was nothing but trees and it was nothing but grass in this park. And next thing I know, she was having a baby in this dream and it was blood all over the place. I can remember this. And my husband had blood on his hands and it was because he was trying to help her to deliver this baby. But as soon as she delivered this baby, it was a boy and this baby kind of like rolled down two steps. It was weird. It was just so weird. And he kind of looked at like an alien and I don't really know how to make up that whole thing but I'm just telling y'all what I dreamed of and right after she pushed this baby out we looked up in the sky and all you could see was these missiles headed straight towards us it was so many missiles headed straight towards us but somehow I knew in a dream the scripture in my mind I had remembered the scripture in revelations where it was I believe it's revelations nine and four when it say touch not the grass and touch not the, uh, the 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 trees the green grass and the trees hurt not those or uh touch not those that have the seal of the mark of god in their foreheads and i didn't have a greater understanding of which i have now when i had this dream a year and a half ago but now that i understand that we are the grass and we are the trees that scripture is saying like those who had the seal of the mark of the uh those who had the mark and the seal in their foreheads of righteousness from the most high uh couldn't be touched couldn't be harmed and that's what that was symbolic of it let me know again in that dream that me and my husband was fine and i guess my sister too because she was with us but basically that we was good and no harm was gonna be brought upon us but i'm telling you the missiles was headed straight towards us there was so many missiles coming from every single direction headed straight towards us and then i woke up <laughs> then I woke up that was it so I don't know if y'all got comments leave comments about the dreams if y'all think y'all got an understanding do leave comments or don't leave comments it's okay but I just really wanted to share these dreams to put them out there and I will be um, routinely consistently coming back sharing my dreams as I have them because I be having so many prophecy dreams that I know the most I be giving to me and I just don't share them I don't be sharing them because I get tired of people be like she lying or that ain't true or this or that always got something to say but at the same time the most I show me like if you're not gonna share you know with my people the visions and the dreams that I'm giving you then I'm gonna stop giving them to you so I had prayed and I had to repent and I pray and I ask most how to start giving me these end time dreams again. So I got more to come back and share to y'all, but I don't know y'all.
Tell me what y'all think. Um, thanks for listening. Shalom.